Hey everybody, it's Murgle. And finally, after all this time, we're getting the legendary catch-up mechanic that probably should have been in-game <laughs> several patches ago. Um, I really think they this is a really good way they're implementing it, right? And I don't understand why it took them this long to do it. Because, let's face it, like some specs were kind of dead content without certain legendaries and... Gosh, if you didn't get the right ones, it just made it a terrible experience, you know? And it just, um, legendaries were always a problem. And this is actually an amazing solution that they're implementing. But why did it take this long to do this? <laughs> Anyways, let's get into it, right? Most of you people that have mains have all your legendaries, or you've collected most of the majority of the ones you're after, things like that. However, if you wanted to play an alt, it was rough, right? You got your first two ones frequently, but to get legendaries constantly, you had to play a lot, a lot to generate legendaries, you know? It, it just, every, obviously they came from everything, but it took a lot of time. Well, they finally implemented the guy you talked to, Arcano Vridial, the guy that gives you the essence that upgrades your legendaries each patch, now is going to be selling a thing called Purified Titan Essence. This is on the PTR, so it won't be implemented until 735, which... Again, my estimated release date, probably the 16th. Everything lines up, makes sense. Um, the 16th means that you're allowed to kill Argus and Entaurus in LFR. So, like, everybody can follow the story after the 16th, since LFR is typically easy. Um, therefore, everything leads to me believing 16th is release date. And they've also updated a lot of the class, the uh, sub-races, things like that. But anyways, the video's about the legendary. So, anyways, you talk to this guy, you trade him. Purified Essence for 175 Awakening Essence. And this generates a random legendary from your specialization. So, um, if I was Affliction and I had no legendaries, it would pick from the list of Affliction legendaries. Bam. I get it. If you have all of the legendaries in the spec, I believe it just generates one randomly from your other specs. So if you wanted to specify, like say you're a druid, and you're specifically after a guardian druid um, legendary, make sure to swap your spec to guardian, or your loot specialization at least. That way it doesn't just randomly generate a resto legendary, you know? So, it's 175 Awakening Essence, and uh, these are pretty easy to come by, right? Awakening Essence is the stuff that you get from doing your emissary caches, killing bosses in the raids, um... Just about everything will give you a majority Awakening Essence. I believe you'd probably be able to generate anywhere from 100 to 150 a week. Somewhere in that range. So 175 isn't that bad because it means it's a week. And then bam, you can get one of these purified Titan Essences. Thus giving you a guaranteed Legendary. Maybe not the one you're after, but at least you're guaranteed to get a Legendary every 175 Essence. So... If you have alts and you're looking to get legendaries on them, I would recommend grinding out the first two because the first two have a very greatly increased chance of generating, right? Because it doesn't say about this essence whether it'll count against your luck counter, right? You know the uh, drop luck that increases if you continually go without a legendary. Every time you loot something that could have generated a legendary, you have a higher chance next time if you didn't get one. I don't know if using this thing will reset the counter because I, I feel like it would be easy for them to make this not count as that, right? But I don't know if the game can differentiate between you generating a legendary from this and magically getting one to resetting your counter. So if you feel like your character is probably close to getting a legendary, I would wait to get a drop and then buy one of these. You know what I mean? Just in case this does reset the luck. But, this is a good fix. I, again, think this should have been in there. Maybe not at the beginning of the expansion, right? At the beginning of the expansion, it was okay uh, that it took a while. But at around 7.1.5 or maybe 7.2, I think this should have already been in there. You know, but better late than never, right? Anyways, if you've got any alts that you would like to play before the end of the expansion or maybe you want to uh, main change before the end of Antorus and the end of Legion start going and running stuff on them 
gather as much Awakening Essence as possible. You could probably get enough for even two Legendaries by the time 735 releases. If you're doing every event and everything. Dailies, Emissary Cash, or stuff like that. Also, Mythic Plus Cash. That thing gives you a lot of Awakening Essence. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I um, hope this is good news to some of you. And I'll see you again real soon. Bye-bye.